Next week, Anthony Quayle stars with Andrew Ray, Sarah Churchill and Cliff Richard in Serious Charge, the story of a vicar accused by a teddy boy and a woman whose advances he spurned of homosexual assault. That's at 20 past 10 next Sunday. Film on 4 this Thursday, Julie Walters takes a holiday. Normal people take normal holidays. <coughs> they lie on beaches in the sun. Get your bum up, Doreen! It tears up! But eight women on an outward bound course is not a normal holiday. What a bunch of maniacs. And when they're not looking for men... I want a man tonight. They're finding them. All finding themselves. I was very young. So was he. Neither of us had done it before. It was awful. Life isn't a rehearsal, you know. This is it. This is it for Julie Walters. She'll be wearing pink pajamas this Thursday night on Channel 4. The Twilight Zone is next, with a tale of the powerful effects of an evil will which can turn people into puppets and transport a town to outer space. It can even turn your television off. Now on for another tale of mystery and imagination from The Twilight Zone. The world of personal finance changes so quickly that it's sometimes difficult to know what's happening to your money. Oracle keeps its ear to the ground and gives you information that's always up to date. Some aspects of personal finance are quite daunting. That makes it all the more important to know what you might be getting yourself into. Because Oracle's not trying to sell you anything, our editorial is as unbiased as it is comprehensive. Stay in touch with your money. Page your Oracle. And now, a special message to blood donors who are moving house. Did you remember to give your new address to your local blood transfusion center? We can't afford to lose a single donor! And we can't afford to lose you! Well, there we are. As we say in the Twilight Zone, all good things must come to an end. And this being a good thing, I'm afraid I've got to end it. But never mind, tomorrow is another good day. And I hope you'll be able to share some of it with me, because otherwise, well, who knows? But for now, from all of us here at Peaksville, it's time to wish you a very good night. <laughs>